Yo, this is starting to piss me off. What the hell's happening, man? What the hell is happening, OBS? What the fuck is happening, bro? The curse is, in fact, very strong today, chat. I don't know what the hell's wrong, but... Something out there does not want me streaming today, and it's starting to piss me off. It was just fine last week. I take a week off and suddenly everything is broken? Like, why? Is it time to un uninstall and reinstall OBS? I don't know. There's no update queued or anything either. I'm wondering, maybe I have to... Maybe my drivers... I mean, there is a new NVIDIA driver I have to install. Maybe that has something to do with it. It was a coffee. Won't happen again. <laughs> That's back. Yeah, I, uh, I reset uh, OBS and now stream element stuff is working again, but... Fuck, man. I just I have a feeling it's just going to happen again. I have no idea why, though. I really don't. I mean, I have got space on my computer for the recording. It's not a space issue. It's not a network issue. Yeah, it's not a space issue. It's not a network issue. It's got to be an OBS issue. Just let me play my fucking creepy stalker game, dude. Alright, let's go see what my messages are. I'll be alright. Okay, so you can't text. Oh no, I have no service still. You probably think there was dog food. Okay, you gotta do what you gotta do. All my messages are like reset. It's kind of weird. Fuck was that? Don't you dare knock on that door. Yo. No, dude. Don't go to bed. Oh. Don't come in here, dude. Stop. Stop. Don't you fucking hello me, bro. There's a mic thing. Wait, maybe I should turn on my mic. Hello? Hello? Bro, go away! What the fuck are you doing? Who is it? Please open the door, I need help. What do you want? I need your help, please, please open the door. Yo, I am not opening the door. You can kiss my fucking ass. I know you're in there. Yeah, I just answered you, dude. What do you mean you know I'm in there? I know you're out there. Please leave. I just need to talk to you. I swear I'm not a cop. Please go away or I'm going to call the cops. Pretty lady. Come on. Oh, fuck me. Oh, shit. Oh, shit.
Nice! To this day, I find it really weird that the manager inferred not to get police involved as it would have affected Motel's reputation and let go of the situation. I believe that the town could have been home to a cult or a drug ring or possibly something even worse. Tommy arrived with the car after what felt like a year. I never want, went on long road trips again. I would always take airplanes. I win? <laughs> YouTube sign has delayed? YouTube is down? Is it still down, chat? Seems to be okay on my end. Congrats, you've survived trauma. It's live, just a new link. Okay. Well, hopefully shit does not go bad again. <laughs> Took us only three crashes. I think it didn't count. Oh my god. What? That was weird. Like, what was what was even happening? Who was the bad guy? Who was that dude? Just a fucking weirdo? Cut kind of killed the mood of the game. Yeah, it uh, it seems um people went who entered the room was the bad guy. Yeah, not much was explained though. I mean. Like, who put the coffee there? The fucking he who, who managed to put an entire rigged coffee machine and then like remove it in the time it took me to go to bed? Hey, I heard you shit talk it, so I decided to be petty with your stream. Creepy stalker, but didn't explain the drug coffee. I mean, yeah, I, that one was a little, I guess, a little longer than the last one, but. I don't know. I don't know. What's the next episode? We got Home Alone, Norwood Hitchhike, Carlson House. All right, should we play this one next? We still got time. I'm going to do it. Fuck it. Let's go through the entire uh, catalog here. We might as well. Car Carson House. Yeah, vending machines are heavy. Tell me about it, dude. <laughs> I mean, that's some dedication to put out an entire coffee vending machine. Without anyone knowing. And then as soon as the person drinks it to like fucking what? Bring it back to your car? Rolling through these games? Yeah, we are. Alright, so we did Norwood Hitchhike. Let's try Carson House. It's a good thing that these are really cheap. I mean, $5 a game is not bad. So, uh, Carson House has very positive reviews, 1590. I assume they only get better with every iteration, right? All right, episode three. I guess it's a good thing that we uh, got that $25 dono today. It looks like today's stream is still in the positive. Feels good. $10 later. This one's even better. All right. All right, the first one was so short. I don't know. The first one was so short. I can't tell if I like it or not. I feel like almost the first one was a little better than the second one, just because I was very confused as to what was happening. 
half the time in the second one. Also, the fact that, like, it was just some random guy at the very end who I had not seen at all prior. Will you be the son of a car in this game? <laughs> Yo, let's go, dude. We got Phoenix Fire sniping a non-sub. Much love, Phoenix. Thank you for your support. Seriously, much love, man. Thank you. I appreciate the gifted sub, Phoenix. You win here gifting subs all the time as well, man. I appreciate you. All right, well, uh, let's go check out fucking Carson House, I guess. Might as well. Let's get through all of them at this point. We have two more after this. All music tracks in this video game are copyright free. Thank you for letting me know straight from the beginning. I really appreciate that. Oh, they're saving in this game. It looks like every game increases playtime by an app by 20 minutes. The first game was 20 minutes, second game was 40 minutes, the third game is an hour. This one actually has save states. Interesting. Alright, Carson House. I hope this one's a little better. The last one wasn't horrible. I was just very confused at the end. And it seemed a little disjointed. Let's hope this one's a little better. My name is Noah. I'm a 28-year-old male from the Midwest. Also, let's hope that this one doesn't include a fucking crash. Things seem to be going all right on my end. Hopefully that was the last time I have to reset... Uh, I had to reset this stream. You're helping me through the grind of chores and work? I'm glad I could be helpful in some way. In these darkest of times of chores and work. I have no idea why I'm sending this, but I hope my story can be a lesson. This happened to me when I was 18, but I remember this incident like yesterday as the trauma dictated a major part of my life. For a little background, my dad was a realtor and almost always became friends with his clients. One day he came home and pitched me a small job offer for the weekend. One of his old clients was going away for a few days and I needed somebody and needed somebody he could trust to watch over his house. This man worked as a cool at a local media company. Dad told me that the man would pay me $100 just to watch the house and do some basic chores. I accepted the offer as I had nothing interesting going on for the weekend. Besides, I thought I could use the time to get my, my schoolwork done. Plus, I wasn't picky where my pocket money came from. My dad drove me to the house. I fear I cannot fathom how wonderful you all are. I hope your days and nights are good. And remember, you are all loved. Oh, thank you, Phantom. Imagine still having to do this. Does anyone does anyone in chat have to do this to get their laundry done? I feel bad for you, bro. Laundry is already such an annoying chore. To have to actually go to some place like this to do it seems like just absolute hell. The only thing that makes laundry bearable these days is the fact that I get to do it from home. Employees only. Am I an employee here? I thought I was gonna watch someone's house. What the fuck? What kind of laundry man is this? Okay, I'm already confused. And yes, I do in fact have to open every single one, dude. I'm 
so sorry, chat. I'm so sorry. I have to do it. Whatever mental illness... Whatever mental illness I have... ...is telling me that this is absolutely necessary. <laughs> oh, you gotta admit, that's pretty satisfying, though. Oh, hell yeah. Get them all open. No washing machine shall go unopened. There's someone over there. Man, this is a lot of washing machines. For some place with absolutely zero customers. I feel like this this laundromat's a little overprepared. Bleach? Excuse me? Where did you put it? Where did I put what what is this place? Where is the bleach? I need bleach. Who are you? What even is this place? I said I need bleach! Oh god, someone give this man his bleach. He, he's got a lot of whites to clean. The man needs his bleach. Noah? Noah? Nap time's over. We're here. We're here. You said you could do this. Wake up now. Wake up, Noah. Noah, wake up! Wait, I have more washing machines to open. Shit. You still think you can do this? I got this, Dad. Roy called and said that the keys should be under the fake rock. Got it. He said it's in the backyard. And like I said, keep the doors locked and don't open the door for anyone. I heard you the first time, Dad. Okay, now get your ass to work. I hope you know I'm only doing it for the snacks. Already high on the first day. Yo, welcome back, snacks to snack a -lottle. Sorry about the dead streams, bro. I don't know what's happening to OBS today, but uh, it is really fucking around. Yo, is this the neighborhood where the first game took place? Alright, under the fake rock. You guys see a fake rock anywhere? That is a dandelion. Oh, from the backyard. the fake rock good dog good home oh they got a pool kind of a shitty pool though my god I think it's tiny oh it's a papa hi the papa oh jabba jabba bee yeah oh jabba jabba bee who's your good boy who's your good boy yeah Who's your good boy? Nice, we have a companion here. Boy? Is his name Boy? You named your dog Boy? Ooh. Hey, you wanna play fetch? Get it! I said, go fetch! God, you really suck at this game, dog. You want to go inside? Okay, let me just find the fake rock real quick. I'll let you in, buddy. Bro, I don't... What fake rock? I don't see a single rock anywhere. There it is. Go on in, buddy. Come on. I'm at work putting keychains together and watching you. Thanks for keeping me company. Thank you for keeping me company, brother. I'm gonna need company, apparently. I had to pee. 
worse. Let's raid the fridge. What they got in here? Ooh, puree, my favorite. Water? <gasps> yes! Oh my god, I can keep hydrated in this game too. Let's go. Let's go, baby. All right, we're back. We're so back, chat. We are so back. We can hydrate in this game. No wonder I have to go pee. First thing I did when I came in here was drink some water. Rail was too lazy to model the garage. Is that a dev joke? Where's the bathroom? Do not disturb for any reason. Yo, sup? I'm in here to disturb. Yo, what's up? I'm in here to disturb. Don't mind me. Oh, is your bubby? Is your bubby? What kind of freaky shit were you filming in here, huh? It's a green screen. Oh, he must have a YouTube video or a YouTube channel. He's on that YouTube grind too, huh? Trying to make a name for yourself? Realize that the house was way bigger than ours. Time to take a pee pee. God damn! He was not joking. He really did need to pee. Well, time to refuel. One message. I'm honestly jealous of Ava Roppel. This little baby. I know, right? I just had the weirdest dream ever. Thanks for taking up the job, kid. I really appreciate you doing this. I'm sorry I had to leave early, Mr. Carson. My bad, it's Roy. Got this contact from Walter. Work is really getting the best of me here. Oh, no problem, Mr. Carson. My pleasure, really. Haha. <laughs> He's my dad. Drink and pee again? Well, I'm definitely drinking again, that's for sure. We gotta keep hydrated. Our strategy for the first game really paid off, so we're gonna take that strategy into this game as well. No matter what happens, chat, we have to keep hydrated. I wouldn't have asked for anyone if it wasn't for Zeke. Zeke? Your throat too weak. Dog couldn't be bothered. <laughs> Boy's been a little sick, sick lately. Oh, I'll take care of him in the house now that I'm here. You have nothing to worry about, Mr. Carson. Is Zeke the uh, dog? You are a lifesaver, kid. Speaking of him, I wanted uh, to remind you it's his dinner time. If you could get him his food from the basement right on it. Why do you keep your dog food in the basement, dude? What? Why even have a house that has a basement? I feel like nothing good ever happens in a basement. If I were going to buy a house and I figured out that it had a basement, I wouldn't buy it. Or I would get someone to, like, cement it away. Cement off the basement. Basements are just never good news, bro. They never, they never... Mr. Carson's bedroom had this weird smell of wet clothes. Wet clothes, huh? You're in Florida, you literally can't have basements. Maybe that's why I have a strong, or part of the reason why I have a strong distrust of basements in general. Why so mad, bro? You should drink some water. It's hard to be mad when you're hydrated. Oh, I'm so glad they reused that.
All right, chat. I guess we're going into the fucking basement where he, for some stupid reason, wants to keep all his dog food. Into the basement we go, chat. Yay. Where is the basement? I've opened every door in here. Oh, God. All right, before we go in there. Tactical drink break. Okay, now we're ready for anything. Basement was a little too dark. Yeah, like every basement in existence. Where is the fucking dog food? I almost forgot. I apologize for the lights in the basement. You can grab the flashlight in the storage room upstairs. You gotta be kidding me. You gotta be fucking kidding me, dude. Dark basements, flashlights. How do you not realize you're in a horror game at this point? It should be common knowledge at this point. If I were in this situation, I would immediately leave. I would text them, nah, fuck that shit, I'm out. I'd call my dad and I would literally leave. Well, thank God I can drink water and use the flashlight at the same time. This game really knows the importance of keeping hydrated. The devs must be hydro homies. Keep hydrated, chat. Drink up. It'll save you from monsters in the basements. Y'all better stay away. I got a full bladder and I know exactly how to use it. I will pee on your chin. I swear to God, I will. Don't try me. I'm crazy. I'm fucking crazy. I'll piss right on that chin. Where's the stupid dog food? Shit, am I gonna have to throw my... Oh, I can't carry the dog food and my water at the same time. This is awful. Alright, one last drink and then we have to throw this. But we'll be back for it. Is that the dog food? Guess so. All right, let's go. All right, Bubba, time for dinner. Bubba. Here you go. It's your favorite. Get up. It's your favorite. Can slop. What do you mean I have to open the damn can? God damn it, bro. This game's too realistic. I gotta find a fucking can opener now? Here you go, chicken guts and cow feet, your favorite. Mmm. Oh, that's a good bubba, yeah. Oh, that's a good bubba, yeah. Oh, that's a good bubba, yeah. Eat up, buddy. You deserve it. You're my friend, Zeke. You and I, we're going to survive this together. You hear me? We're going to survive this together. Hold on, Carson. I gotta go get my water. 
God, it's been a long time. I need a drink. Why in the basement? <laughs> it's an inconvenient place to keep dog food. Yeah, you got to go down there every single time you want food. Come on, dude. Yo, Firek, welcome to the chat, man. I'm glad that you enjoy my fear and hunger stuff, brother. There will be more fear and hunger stuff to come as soon as uh, Miro decides to release his next update. I can't wait to play it. Alright, now what? Hey kid, heard from Alter, you're a computer whiz. I have a favor to ask. My computer has been acting weird lately and my whole security system is tied to it. Oh yeah, you got a whole security si uh, system set up here? I'm gonna text Evelyn. Why can't I text my friends in this game? This is, this is horrible. Horrible immersion. Have a lot of expensive equipment laying around. Don't want anything to happen to it. I understand. I'll take a look at your computer. Hmm. Yes. Upon further inspection, this is in fact a computer. Hold on. I need to drink up a bit. Feeling a little parched. Thanks, kid. Alec Carson, 5387. You're just going to give me your password? Bad move, buddy. Why can't I get in there? Yo, the smile in the void. Welcome on in, brother. Had to go for a while. Is this a slice of life anime or a cartoon? A slice of life anime. I'm not sure. I don't really get slice of life anime vibes from this thing. What is happening? Let me use the computer! For fuck's sake! Is that not the computer he was talking about? Is there another computer? Maybe I gotta find another computer. Watch it be in the basement. I bet this freak keeps his computer in the basement too. Fucking weirdo. I mean, that's the only computer I've seen. I'm gonna check upstairs. Never mind, this goddamn house is a fucking maze. Hello? Cable is getting fucking weird. Couldn't open it from there. Aha! 
Mr. Carson's office looked like a good spot I could sit down and work at. Mr. Carson has three computers in his house. Looks like every LSD strip. <laughs> your shorts, your shorts may be by terminate. I'm currently in the process of understanding this game and trying to survive, even though I'm getting my ass beat. It's kind of fun. Termina? All right. I guess it's a good thing you started with Termina then. Because if you started with the first fear and hunger, God help you. I remember I was doing calculus that night. Rainbow OS. Did I do my calculus first? I did have schoolwork to do, but I wasn't feeling it at the time. Yeah, uh, schoolwork? You're never gonna feel like doing schoolwork, son. Alec Carson 5387. Meow, meow. What am I doing wrong here? Oh, first one is capitalized. Alec Carson. Welcome. Da -da 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 -da. Ooh. Shit. Free trial for limited period. What? What do you mean free trial? Your children catch colds. Your computer catches viruses. Get full protection. Ooh, should we uh, download the antivirus 96? What do you think, chat? Guess the flag.exe. System has encountered a critical error. God, this looks like my fucking computer. This is my computer every time I try to fucking stream. Egg.xc. What? Inet7. Yo, can this computer do anything? What kind of virus do you have in here? Oh. Recycling bin. Test one. Guide to being a... Guide to being a better person. Talk and Talk, directed by Alec Carson. In this video, we will be covering how to talk like a better person. Also, oh, this is what Alec was doing down there. Feel free to take a break whenever needed. Step one, don't be rude. Being rude will discourage people from talking to you. Sorry, it appears that something is wrong with the broadcast. In the meantime, enjoy some happy images. Aww. Is it puppy? Remain calm in any conversation. Step two. Now, even though what he said was controversial, did you stay calm? <laughs> the secret to being calm is not to let your feelings interfere with the conversation. Being calm makes you a better person. That's all we have for today. Yo, these nuts was in there. These nuts was literally in there. Let's go, dude. Interesting. Right. Okay. Um, yeah, honestly, I think you have a very exciting career in the YouTube space. That's the kind of video that would net you at least two dozen views.
That PC fan running hard. Yeah, it's an old PC. Listen, don't judge him, okay? He hasn't been able to upgrade. I guess let's get full protection. Let's go ahead and download an antivirus into this man's computer. I'm sure he'll appreciate that. Fix clean and speed up your PC. Virus protection, malware protection, threat defense, PC tools. Hey, uh, pro tip chat, never, ever, 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 ever download something like this in real life. Okay, do yourself a favor. Protect your system with effective antivirus solutions. Live 24-7 threat monitoring, anti-bot protection, multi-layer threat defense, and one-click installation. Up-to-date virus definition. Download now. Let's do it. Oh, he's going to be so happy. He's going to be so happy with this virus that I literally just downloaded it straight into his motherboard. Welcome to Antivirus 96. Virus definition up to date. Malware protection on. Firewall on. Perform full scan. I want to play guest a flag. But everything else results in a critical error. Security threat, Troj Osk A, risk high, infected location, rainbows, system 55, results, threat not removed, remove them. This is safe? It's not putting spyware and malware in your PC? Yeah, no, not at all. Definitely not at all. Your, uh, this guy's social security number has definitely not been compromised now. Antivirus removed. Can I do things now? Program can't start because uh, DLL is missing from your computer. Try reinstalling the program to fix this problem. It's done. It was just some Trojan. I'd recommend you only download softwares from trusted websites. Tell that to my kid, but thanks. I'll drop you a nice tip when I get back. All right, I'm going to keep snooping around your computer, old man. He really does have a whole security system here. Damn, he's still eating? Shit. Damn it, I really want to reinstall egg.exe. What country is this flag? Zambia. Let's go. Brazil. Bro, wait, I'm actually really good at this. My God, I'm goaded. Let's go, bro. I'm so smart. Honduras. That's definitely Azerbaijan. Oh my God. Yo, I'm on a roll. Smartest person alive, baby. That's Jamaica. Shit. Uzbekistan for sure. Yeah, everyone knows the Uzbekistan flag. Come on, you gotta be a real dumbass not to know the Uzbekistan flag. They teach this in grade school, guys. Come on. That one's easy. Vietnam. This one is Ethiopia. Fuck! This one is obviously Zambia. Oh my god. Oh, I failed. What? Are these flags even real? This one is Bosnia. This one is... Ah, shit. Mauritania. Jesus Christ. Guyana. That's Poland. Oh, my God. 
Venezuela, Sudan, Vietnam, Venezuela. Oh my lord, I'm failing so bad now. That's Bosnia, my home country, so it is a real flag? <laughs> Yo, someone new. Sorry you're going through a fever, bro. I hope you feel better. Uh, oh shit, I wanted to say Portugal. Somalia. That one's Belgium. This one's... Madagascar. Shit, Samoa? Denmark. Oh man. Damn, that's a that's a cool flag. What the hell? Georgia? <laughs> I doubt that's the Georgian flag. Sri Lanka, obviously. Senegal, Bulgaria, Senegal. Qatar. Damn it. Cameroon. God damn it. Congo. God damn it. Yugoslavia. Fuck! Burkina Faso. Oh, man. Bro, these can't be real flags. Yo, how, how long does this go? Are we going to do every single flag? Zambia. How many flags are there? Barbados. Okay. You know, I'm starting to think that they're literally just going to do every single flag in existence. Holy Jesus. It really is every single flag. It never stops. Okay, I give up. I guess the Poland flag wrong. Okay, I was kind of the rushing through it there at the end. Some of these flags I've never seen. Some of those countries I've never heard of. Shit. It's not letting me search what I want to search. How do I get egg XC to start working again? I guess I gotta go. All right, let's go. Our shitty limited American education. Hey, I was doing pretty good while I was, uh, you know, actually trying for the most part. Man, you know, all that flag guessing really got me thirsty. Let's take a sip. Fuel the old piss cannon, if you will. Singer invader from space reveals truth about nut allergies. Bites tiger attacking police. What the fuck is happening in this town? Swedish woman marries parrot in big wedding. Yo, where does this guy live? That looks like AI art. Now what, chat? Bubba's still eating there. In 
2024, that news sounds normal. True. I guess you're right. I just realized that the fucking name of my water is Fort Lax. Fort Lax. Right. What am I supposed to be doing now? Just had the weirdest dream. What was it about? Weird reminds me of cooking with Jeffrey on Channel 10 last night. By the way, the rerun must be on right now. You got to watch it with me. Wait, that place got a TV? Yeah, hold on. Bro, I don't know, man. The last time I turned on the TV in this fucking place, I was thrown for a loop. I change the channel? I don't want to watch Korra. The last airbender was way better. Hello. Welcome. Cooking with Jeffrey. I'm Jeffrey. And today we are cooking cat food. Ooh, cooking cat food. I love me cat food. It's my favorite. It's my favorite Doesn't dish. Delicious? We can't eat this. It's raw. So first, we are going to gently pour the cat food onto this conveniently placed pan on a stove. Yo, what kind of brain rot is Gen Z watching these days, guys? This is really ridiculous. I will be preparing what's known as a piece of cardboard dipped in milk. <laughs> we will need a piece of cardboard, a glass, and some milk. Just, we poured the milk into the glass. <laughs> I think you should get the groceries. I think you should get the I think you should get the groceries before it gets too dark. There's some cash in my nightstand. I'm on it. Hold on, I gotta finish watching uh, Cooking with Jeffrey. Wow, that was enlightening. I'm the hand merchant. What? Buy some hand. Don't have hand? I'll give you hand. Got too many hands to handle? <laughs> I'll take them. I got the best hand. Oh. Only the highest quality hands for you. Now what can I do with these hands? Got too many fingers. I'll take them. Not enough fingers? I'll give you four fingers. People love hands. They're great. I got so much hand. Amazing hand. I'll sell you good quality hands. Come on down today to buy some hands. I have nice hands. Yo, you guys want some hands? Hello. I'm the hand merchant. Buy You're missing hands. the best part. Yeah, well, sorry, you man. Have hands? I'll give you hands. Got too many hands to handle? I'll take them. <laughs> Yo, he's got the best hands, chat. Oops. Got too many fingers. I'll take them. Gotta head off. Good luck with the stream. Hopefully no more issues on your end. Uh, your end. Thank you, blank blank. Yeah, hopefully. We've been going strong for an hour now, so uh, I hope that's good news. Yo, he's got amazing hands. I could use a few hands.
wants me to get groceries in the middle of the night. Where am I even supposed to get groceries from? or something could I use these hands sure if you're willing to pay for them I think that's the I couldn't just leave like that well how am I supposed to get the groceries then am I supposed to walk into someone else's house and steal it from their fridge unless he wants me to order them there's some cash in my nightstand oh I gotta go get the cash first I think smells like wet clothes cash all right i picked up some cash a hundred dollars god damn okay for your trouble get something for yourself as well it's on the house sweet will do excuse me can you give me a ride to the grocery store all right fuck you then I guess I'll just walk. You can take Alex's bike. It's outside near the garage. Bingo. All right, we're actually riding to the store. Let's go. So far, we've just been doing chores and watching hand commercials. Twenty two PM. Oh, God, I'm so sorry. <laughs> there are other reasons I could have died that night. <laughs> sorry, man, there's no bike lane. What do you want me to do? That's fine. Hickory Brothers Plumbing and Heating. Can I go in here? No? I wanted to visit the Hickory Brothers, though. Day quality upholstery. All right, I don't think I can go anywhere else. Hello, sir. How you doing? Doing good, you? Doing good. Use the shopping basket. Okay. All right, now what the hell's on this list? Man, I really am just going around doing chores, huh? Ranch, strawberry jelly, chocolate spread, milk and eggs, garden peas, honey, rice, ketchup, and milk and eggs. Again. Hi, lady. And speak of the devil, Turner and Andy? Bro, your girl was here. She just left. What are you talking about? Eve? What was her name? Kara or something? Dude, I said they're not dating anymore. Oh, yeah. He hopped. Excuse me, ma'am. I'm trying to talk to my homies here. Could you not fucking phase into my basket? I am not taking you home, okay? We're not buying you. Can you leave? Thank you. Oh, yeah. He hopped uh, to that other chick so quick I didn't even realize. 
Don't listen to him. But dude, she bought tons and tons of cans. I think she's throwing like a party or something. You know, anything about it? Bro, she looks way older without the makeup. Milf energy, bro. D what? Dude. Ew, I think she's more of like a goth. Goth, goth milf energy. When are you going to grow up, Turner? Anyways, dude, what are you doing tonight? How sitting for this guy, Carson, tonight? You mean at the... at Alex? He goes to school with my sister. Heard kid's a real weirdo, especially since his parents split up. Whatever fills my pocket, I'm in for. Alright, dude. See you at school on Monday, then. See you around, Nandy. I'll see you around. So my ex came here and bought a bunch of cans, and they thought that she was gonna use it for a party? Ah, yes. Just what every party needs. Cans. Ranch strawberry jelly. Fuck me, bro. Where am I gonna find this shit? Yo, y'all know where the fucking strawberry jelly is? Oh, we need peas. Okay. We need eggs. Hey, son. Do you work here? Possibly. Why? I'm looking for mustard. My son likes mustard, but I can't find it for the life of me. Do you know where it is? Let me get it for you, ma'am. Oh, how nice of you. I'll be right over here. Okay, let's get this lady mustard. I don't know why I'm acting like I work here. Maybe I'll get something out of it. Ma'am, I'm gonna keep it a buck with you. I actually don't know where the fucking mustard is, mustard is either. That's curry sauce. Ooh, nut butter. God, I love nut butter. Is that mustard in your basket? Could you get me one too? I, wait, that's for you. Do I need mustard in my basket? I actually don't need mustard. Okay, here. What the hell? I don't need mustard. Do I just throw it at her? Take your fucking mustard, lady! God damn it. Yo! Take your mustard! It's literally right here! It's right here, please. Bro, I have the mustard. I literally have the mustard. Take it. Oh my god, I'm going to fucking slap you, lady. Take your goddamn mustard. Bro, can you take your mustard? You're literally looking at it! Oh my lord almighty. Oh my god. You want some mustard, lady? Here. Yeah, it is mustard in my fucking basket. How could you tell? Uh, it's fine. Look, I got a bunch. Just take one. For the love of God, just take one. Just take your fucking mustard, lady. Oh my lord, I'm gonna kill her. I'm gonna fucking kill her. I'm gonna fucking kill her. How do I get her damn mustard? Can you take your fucking mustard? Very well. There it is. Ha. <laughs> Thank you, son. I hate everything. I got nothing for that. I literally got nothing for that. Of all the ways to die in a horror game, getting hit by a card is the one you chose. I mean, I knew I wasn't going to die there. I'm built different. Simply put, I am built different. Garden peas, get honey, strawberry jelly, and ranch. There's a ranch. I think I need ketchup, right? Ketchup. Is that hot sauce? Is that chocolate? Choco spread? Spready? Okay, choco spread. Some honey. Some jam. I got the ranch. Milk. I need milk now. And rice. I need milk and rice. Milk. <laughs> Wait, does that count as milk? Is milk the same thing? I don't trust it. 
I'm getting fresh milk. Alright, so now we need rice. But Uncle Tony's rice only. Uncle Tony. Alright, I think that's everything. Milk and eggs, ketchup, rice, honey, peas, chocolate spread, ranch, and strawberry jelly. How's it going with the new chick, by the way? It's pretty good. Alright, good talking, bro. What? You what? Should I build this for you? Yes, please. Thanks for shopping at Nux. You have a good one. Thanks, man. Should I buy something for myself? Tomorrow I'll start treatment with medicine. I hope I stay the same. I'm sure you will. Hopefully everything goes well. Yo, Jesus. Clean up on aisle three. Somebody had a mustard attack over here. Rude. I can steal things. Alright, I'm leaving. I got everything I needed. Time to go home. Whoops. Man, I really am just playing house here. I'm doing a bunch of chores. When do things get scary? <laughs> Can you trash this place? I already did. Wait, where do where does he live? Let's get off. I forgot where my house is. I had to pee again, and I was starting to feel a little hungry around that time. Oh, you had to pee again? I wonder why. Still had a lot of schoolwork to catch up on. Hopefully he doesn't mind that I left his bike out in the middle of the road. On second thought, maybe I should have taken the bike. I thought I was close to my house. Where the fuck is my house? Which house was it? I literally already forgot. I think it's this one. Zeke, I'm home! Very nice. Let's go put all our groceries away. Eh, fuck, I'm just gonna leave it there. Thought I'd get some schoolwork done now. I have to pee though. Hold on. Also, I'm feeling a little, uh, a little thirsty. Oh, God, it's been way too long. Love drinking my Fort Lax water. Oh, God, toilet, toilet, toilet. Oh, oh. Beautiful. I knew that. Well, out one tube in another. That was a lot of pee. I gotta replace the water in my system. Yo, when does something happen? Yo, Andy, what the fuck? Dude, you said you're a Carson, right? You need to see this. Search up Roy Carson divorce on the internet right now. Roy Carson divorce. This is not what I was looking for. Roy Carson, co-founder of BN Media, claims to be receiving death threats from the angry fans of his ex-wife. 
co-founder of Vienna Media allegedly receiving death threats from the angry fans of his ex-wife. What? These aren't nudes. Hunter News, it's not unusual for audience to be nosy about some of the celebrities' personal matters, but sometimes it's just too overbearing. We see something similar with the case of Roy Carson, the coup and co-founder of BN Media after his very public breakup and divorce with his wife. Former actress Alyssa Brown Carson has allegedly been receiving death threats from the fans of Alyssa Brown for the a rumored infidelity that underwent within the said relationship. Damn, they fucking doxed him? How are you gonna put a picture of his house? <laughs> That's fucked up, dude. They just fucking doxed to ass. Hunter News, bro. What is that? Sources say Roy Carson has people knocking on his door to confront him. Alyssa hasn't been very vocal about the situation yet, but Hunter News is actively trying to reach out to her. So you, the reader, stays updated about the situation. Describe. Oh, Christ. Who's here? Sir? The way that dude stops peeing when he's done freaks me out. Yeah, like, seriously though, like, no, no squirts after. You gotta squirt a little before, like, after you're done with the mainstream. There's still a little in there. You gotta kind of, like, you know, flex your kegels a bit. Where'd he go? Who is it? Your delivery for your one medium size from Pizza Depot, sir. I didn't order any pizza. Your one medium size pepperoni pizza, sir. Ooh, pizza, open. You might be at the wrong address. This is 224 Boulevard, right? That's correct. It's ordered by the name of uh, Roy Carson. I mean, free pizza is free pizza, chat. He's fucking gone. Wait, he actually does have a pizza. What are you smiling about, you freak? What the hell is that? I mean, it is pizza. Here. Thanks. Hey, this is probably a very strange request, but do you think I can wait inside until the rain's over? It's probably not very safe to be out here right now, and I forgot my raincoat at the shop. Not sure my dad would like that. He's upstairs. Oh, I understand. Well, you have a good day. Start eating just one cucumber a day. See what happens to your body. Just one cucumber a day, chat. Maybe you won't get harassed by random free pizzas. I've glitched the water into myself. That's awkward. <laughs> Shit, now I'm double watered up on a Tuesday night. Alright, fuck it. I guess I'll just forever have water on me. Yo, Evelyn hit me with the WYDD. 
Look out for some pizzas. It should arrive any minute now. Enjoy. Maybe I should have let him in. Channel 10. This is the cop show? Oh, fuck yeah. Oh my god. Introducing Spooks, brought to you by Channel 10. Do you hear that? Jack, are you doing your work? You'll have to spend the night in the dungeon if you don't. If you tell me what the radius of two squared is, we'll think about sparing you. Not the My dungeon. Name is Jack Bardex. I have been held hostage by Mr. Holland for 37 days. He makes me solve math work until my head hurts. I can't escape. <laughs> Can I use the bathroom? <laughs> Whoa. Yo, Jack's a gin. Run, Jack, run. Get out of there. Don't use the bathroom. Turn around. Leave. Fly out of there. God, it must be hard being a flying torso with no arms or legs. Do it, Jack. Come on. Damn it. He fucked up. He was too late. Hope everything is okay. Yeah, everything's fine. I think I'm watching Skibbity Toilet. I'm the toilet man. Come over here. I'm the toilet man. I'm the toilet man. Come over here. I'm the toilet. I'm the toilet. I'm the toilet man. So this is Skibbity Toilet, huh? Yo, how much of this pizza can I eat? I really gonna eat the whole thing? I mean, I'm a fat ass, but even I don't think I can handle a whole large pizza. This boy's a uh, a black hole. I'm gonna take the one cucumber day challenge, but not orally. Oh God. <laughs> I can tell you what happens to your body if you don't do it orally, okay? And it's not good. Eventually, you'll put so many cucumbers up there that they will come out of your mouth. Start eating just one cucumber a day. See what happens to your body. Eventually, it would be orally. Fuck, hold on. I gotta finish my pizza. God, I really did eat the entire pizza. Jesus Christ. I am a fatty. Who's there? I knew I heard a knock at the door. I'm gonna go check the cameras. I should have closed the TV. What do you mean close the TV? That makes no sense. You can't close TVs. And so I did. Couldn't open it from there. I guess this water bottle really is just mine to keep now, huh?
Where's the dog? Oh, he's in there. Okay, Zeke is Zeke is okay. There's no one, in, no one in the front, right? They left the package. There's like some flowers there or something. Any pizza can be a personal pizza if you believe in yourself. You have a void for a stomach. Who is it? There's no one there. But they left me some flowers. Aww, chat, we have a secret admirer. Oh my god, they're beautiful. Mmm, I've never received random flowers before. Should we put them in the vase? What do you think? Can I grab a knife? I know what to do. That's right, drinking some Fort Lax. The world's your oyster when you have some Fort Lax. Sorry, I got caught up with work. Good night, Eve. Sweet dreams. Yo, Roy. Were you expecting some flowers? Or are these for me? You're real sweet, dude, but I've got a girlfriend. Bro, I love the glitched water bottle that's just forever in my hand now. I am taking Hydro Homie to a new level. I am one with the Hydro Homie. How are you? What did you have for dinner? He's, uh, it was real good. God damn it, let me send shit. I've got so many messages up. I assumed it was a wrong number. It was strange, but I dismissed the thoughts, the thought as a weird coincidence and move on. Besides, I had a lot of work to catch up on. Okay, we'll leave that there. I feel so special. I've never gotten flowers like that. Oh my god. Engrossment. <laughs> oh, I'm so incredibly engrossed in this blank sheet of notebook paper. God, I've never seen lines so blue and straight. Holy shit, I stared at those blue lines for so long, it's 1.36 a.m. now. While I was in the middle of my schoolwork, the power went off. Power was out, couldn't continue with my schoolwork like that. You gotta be kidding me. What the hell? Are you by yourself? Why do you keep ignoring me? Why are you always mean to me? You're being very immature right now. Fine, if you're gonna be like that, I don't need you anyways. Todd is so much harder anyways. Who the fuck are you, bitch? In that moment, I was almost certain that it had to be another prank by Turner. I just knew guys like him very well. Power went back on. Him was the only one that was uh, that knew I was house sitting alone. Alec Carson, fifty three eighty seven.
You have a Yandere Stalker? Maybe. Someone saw you destroy that pizza and got ideas. <laughs> they should keep those ideas to themselves, all right? Just because I can gobble down an entire large pizza by myself doesn't mean that the same applies to cock. Although, let's be honest, I could probably gobble down a large cock all by myself, too. Where's the Bubba? Yo, Zeke better be okay. <gasps> did you see that? Nah, dude, did you see that? What the hell was that? Look, you can do whatever you want to me, but don't touch Zeke, I swear to God. What are you playing now? We're playing the third one of this game. Fears to fathom. Fuck, where did I leave my... Where did I leave my flashlight, chat? Where the hell did I eat that thing? Nah, dude. Bro, I can't see shit. Where's my flashlight? Oh, no. What have I done? Carson apparently had power backup for his security system. Damn it, and they took my water away. What am I supposed to do if I can't hydrate? My entire defensive strategy involves me hydrating constantly. Without it, I'm screwed. Screwed, chat. What am, what am I supposed to do if I can't piss on my opponents? I'm eating a whole large pizza when I get home tonight. It'll be great. God, why are you trying to make me jealous? Why are you trying to make me jealous, bro? I was gonna buy a whole large pizza, but then I had to. Then I have to. Then I had to spend twenty five dollars on fears to fathom today. So there goes my pizza money. Oh, the bike is still out there. Where did I leave my flashlight? Can I grab a knife now? I'll give old buddy an old London handshake, yeah? Give him an old London handshake, yeah? Grab the knife. You fucker. Grab the fucking knife. Jesus Christ. That's a bad idea. That's a bad idea. I'm not going outside. Are you crazy? Where the hell did I leave that flashlight? Do we need to remind you? Don't stick your dick in crazy. But I haven't stuck my dick in anything. Yet. Chat, we gotta find that flashlight. It's gotta be out here somewhere. You know what? It might be in the kitchen. I probably threw it out to get more water. I got a can opener. 
Fantastic. Now we're set, baby. Wait, do you think maybe? Yes. Okay, we're fine, chat. Hydration is in check again. Bladder is lo locked and loaded. I will pee on anyone who dares make the mistake of crossing me. Piss break, hold on. No, wait, I needed that ammo. Shit. That's fine, I'll just refuel. You think if you filled up your bladder enough and drank enough water constantly that you could turn yourself into a never-ending fountain? Like if you just sit there peeing and just keep drinking water? And already have so much water in your system that it just constantly keeps flowing out? And you just sit there constantly peeing and drinking water? It was suddenly very cold outside. Mini wants us to test this. You're on, Mini. Theoretically, it could work. Like, if you had enough water in your system, and then you started peeing, and then you just kept drinking water while you peed, and you just never stopped drinking water, so that you're just in a constant state of passing urine. Someone should try doing that for science. Just sit there chugging water and pissing for the rest of your life. Like a never-ending, like a never-ending fountain. You can turn yourself into a Greek statue. Maybe the flashlight is back in here. That's a bad idea. I can't see shit. Bro, I feel like the game kind of, like, I feel like the game needed you to have that flashlight in this situation. So the fact that I don't have it, I feel like I'm kind of fucked here. Should I reset? I don't know where that damn thing is. It literally, it just disappeared. I think you'd be waterboarded. <laughs> Not possible with human biology. Hmm. But you're saying there's a chance if I weren't human. Chat, I've checked everywhere. The fucking flashlight is just gone. It's literally gone. I don't know what to do. I think I have to reset. I can't find that thing anywhere. It's gone. Like, where could it be? I've searched every floor in this stupid house. What is the dog keep, dog keep barking at? I was trying to look for the dog. Is he in the front? might be in the front, but I'm scared to go to the front. I don't think I have a choice, though. So. Alright, Zeke. Jesus Christ, I'm lost. What you doing, Zeke? There's definitely someone in that bush. I turned the power back on. I could tell that someone had cut the power off from the outside. Buddy? Had to be Turner. He was really starting to piss me off now. 
Zeke was acting very weird. What's wrong, buddy? Tell me. Speak to me, Zeke. Is he in the is he in the house now? Zeke, come with me, boy. Don't leave me alone, please. Where are you going? Welcome back, Peacemaker. You are right in time for the thick of things. Wait, there's something missing. I feel naked right now. I know what it is. Perfect. Now I'm hydrated, I can take on the world. Who are you? You said we'd stay friends. Turner, this is not funny. I know it's you. Yo, let's look for that flashlight now that there's some light. I have to get back to my schoolwork for Monday. Schoolwork? What do you mean schoolwork, bro? This is not a time for calculus. 